Look at the front where it says Ames real big. We're in Youngstown, Ohio. We're at a Dollar Tree. This one's in an old, uh, I think an old Walgreens, it looks like. I could be wrong. Either way, it's an old pharmacy, whether it was a Rite Aid, Walgreens, CVS, either way. We're going to go see what they have inside of this one for Easter 2022. This one's a cool one. Let's go in. The Weekly Wow. <laughs> Fuck 25. That's okay. Oh, I love these ones. Wow. Okay, yeah, they got a lot of Easter goodies. A lot of Easter goodies. Look at all the Easter eggs. A lot of Easter eggs. For a buck twenty-five. Look at that. Aren't those cute with the starfish, the sharks, clownfish, farm animals. That's cool. Or zoo animal. Either way. You got bunnies, little chicks, carrots. Lots of Easter grass. Lots of Easter signs. Wow. Easter. Happy Easter. Welcome. With the gnomes. What is with the gnomes thing this year? They have a lot of window clings. Decorative carrots. If you want to make like little pieces that you could put together like for a tabletop. <laughs> Carrot patch. Pick your own. Cottontail farms. I like that one too. Happy Easter. Boy, they have a lot of cute little signs. I like this one. I think I got this one last year. Pretty sure I did. I have to put up my Easter stuff. I haven't done that yet. I don't want to buy anything yet. Just in case I already have it at home. This one's nice, though. Happy Easter. That's a cute one. And look, they got more Easter eggs. They got scallops. Bunnies. Happy little bunnies. They got camo eggs. More Easter grass. They got shiny Easter grass with gold. Holographic green ones. Look at these little baskets here. Ribbon. More eggs. They're little cupcake eggs. What a great selection here. Little doorknob hangers that ring. Garland. I think I got those for sure. Pretty sure I did. Gel clings. They're nice and all, but man, they're a pain to get off the glass. Look at these. These are cute. The egg garland. That's pretty nice. I like that, actually. Tinsel. I know I got some last year. I don't want to get any yet, just in case. I don't want to get the same one if I don't need it. This chick is ready for Easter. <laughs> Very nice. Let's see what else they got. Oh, by the way, I did fail to mention the Lego eggs. Those are cool. And the doormats. I got a doormat last year. Actually, I got that one that you see on top. That's pretty cool. I'm glad to see that again. Summer's coming, so they got garden stuff all out. That's awesome. Planners. Perfect. Here's more Easter goodies here. Look at the Easter socks. Little chicks, little rabbits, a little, looks like a chihuahua or something with Easter eggs. I don't know. Spring fling. Happy Easter. Join the egg hunt. Table covers. They have bunny ice cube trays it's like a bunny butt and they have the face on those ones treat bags fabric gift bags shaped gift bags now they have trays here for when you dye easter eggs you can put them in there to dry or if you want to give them up for people to eat like hard-boiled eggs or whatever my cousin loves hard-boiled eggs i'm not a big fan i like the candy dishes with the carrots there's one with bunnies on it those are kind of cool Easter basket gifts. What is this? Like a little bath set? Yeah. Like little nail bath set. Little cups. Little hopping toys. The little... These things, you just push a button and it shoots the propeller up. Paddle ball. Little hopping toys. Stampers. Great for Easter baskets for little kids or for kids of any age, really. Erasers. Over here, they have lots of headbands. They have... They have silly glasses, novelty glasses, pink or blue, lots of pink and blue cups as well, candy containers that are shaped like eggs, 
Okay, look at all the different color headbands. I like the uh, rainbowy ones. Then they even have Easter baskets. Well, they're more like buckets here. But technically, they're considered Easter baskets. Pretty cool. I like these ones that are open like that. The detail on them is pretty nice for a buck twenty-five. Then in these boxes here, we have lots of little stuffed animal friends. Look at that—the little purpley and blue bunny matches Kayla's hair. <laughs> I like when she had purple and blue mixed together. That looked good. Any hair color she does looks good though. Happy Easter! Join the egg hunt. That's pretty nice. They're like, I don't want to say like cardboard, but the, the, the basically like that. These are nice too. Now, see, this is where you can put like those decorative eggs in it. Like I was showing you guys down that way. You can put them in there, put like a little bit of Easter grass in there, make something neat like I did last year. I'll have to put that back out. Those carrots you could put in like a planter. Gnomes. Jeez. All right, we found the aisle with all the candy. They have a lot of candy here, too. What's this, powder candy? I guess the eggs are filled with, like, that pixie stick candy. They have airheads. Starburst. Not bad for a buck twenty-five. Krabby Patties. Warheads. Peanut butter filled eggs. They have white chocolate, milk chocolate. Warheads, caramel eggs, chewy bunnies from Warheads. I wonder what those would be like. Obviously, they're going to be sour, but I wonder how bad. Now, see, when I was a kid, Warheads used to be a heck of a lot stronger. They're weak nowadays. They even have sour with watermelon jelly beans. They have dum-dums, like me. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> There's only one dum-dum out there. Well, a couple, but they're not worth mentioning. Little friends. If they wanted to be normal, then they wouldn't be dumb dumb. But when they act dumb, that's what they're going to get called. Some people may know who I'm referring to. Chocolate covered bunnies. Marshmallow bunnies, anyway. They have more bunnies here. Jelly beans. Great for Easter baskets. Or even if you just have a candy dish at home like we do. Easter crosses. I have a good selection here. Cookies and cream, Sour Patch, Krabby Patties, Truffles, Reese's Peanut Butter Eggs. You got four of them in there for a buck twenty-five. That actually isn't that bad of a deal considering those uh, chocolate-covered uh, cherries that Kayla likes. Carrot Patch Pete. Happy Hoppers. They have Reese's Peanut Butter Eggs in here. A cute little bag. You get a bunch in there. Very cool. So yeah, you, you can see a good selection of candy in here for sure. Now let's go up here and look at the Easter cards that they have. For a buck twenty-five, and some of them are even two for a dollar, they have a great selection versus places like Meyer, Walmart, all the big stores where you'll pay five, six, sometimes even seven or eight dollars for cards. And here they are for a buck twenty-five, and some of them, like I said, two for a dollar. Now it is before St. Patrick's Day when I'm here, so you do see some St. Pa Patrick's Day cards still. We're a few days away from the actual holiday, but look at the good selection I have here. These ones are two for a dollar. They make them for everybody as well. For friends, Easter, I saw like Lord and Pastor, Pastor and wife, Pastor and family, from the cat, from the dog. <laughs> they have them for just about anybody. Very cool. And they even have more behind me, too. That wasn't all of them. These ones are a dollar. So, yeah, they still do have things in here for a dollar. Across the miles. Great selection. And that's about the rest of them. Now, how about we just go through the store real quickly? We won't do a full store tour, but look at this. You know when it's an old pharmacy. 
and you see me up on those mirrors that's a great security feature you can see up every aisle we'll see if people are shoplifting and like with every other pharmacy like all Walgreens that I've been in the mirrors go all the way across pretty sure this was a Walgreens there's toys arts and crafts pet supplies boy look how long these aisles are too lots of picture frames pet toys they have cat food cat treats wow big selection of cat treats too very cool look at this cat toy has a bell inside i bet our kitties would like that we try to spoil them with as many toys as we can and now we're getting into hardware i love our kitties We can't have a dog where we live, but we probably would have one because Kayla loves dogs. Look at all the DVDs. I'm not going to go through them today because I'll be here for a while. But that's a good that's a good amount there. I'm just kind of glancing at them real quick. If I ever saw that thumb wrestling DVD, I'd probably buy that. I mean, that's just so ridiculous. <laughs> Here's a look at the front of the store, where the pharmacist probably would have been. Now we're in the food aisles. Fantastic. Yep. Oh, they got more Easter stuff over here too. Look, more Easter eggs. They have little trucks too. The trucks are cool. The bunny ones with the bunny feet. Look, dinosaur eggs. Very cool. Brain teasers. Oh, those are always fun. Seeds. Oh, good. Yeah, spring is coming, so got to get ready. Look at all the St. Patty's Day stuff they have in here, too, with just a few days to go. They have a lot. Very cool. A lot of tinsel. Wow. I don't really celebrate St. Patrick's Day because I'm not Irish, but that's pretty cool. Anyway, that's a pretty good look at the store here. Let's go back here. Take a look at the dairy. This might have been where the pharmacist was back here. A lot of dairy and frozen foods. Not the biggest we've seen, but not bad either. Pretty nice clean store, well stocked. Well stocked. Look, they got full blown cereal here. Very nice. It isn't Easter without peeps. They have the party cake peeps, the regular ones. Little hugs. I haven't seen those in a hot minute. Very cool. Sour Patch candy. Oh, look, more St. Patty's Day stuff. Placemats, felt decor, wall decor. Silly, but fun. Those are cool. Balloons. More candy. Oh, look, more St. Patty's Day goodies. They have LED string lights for a dollar. Not bad. Well, $1.25. Pretty cool. Oh, I didn't even notice all these peeps. They have cotton candy, they have blue ones, coffee. Ooh, I don't know about that. Cotton candy, sparkly wild berry. Cookies, more candy. Very cool. Oh, they have coloring books and activity books over here. Tappy Easter. All right. All right, well, that's going to wrap up our look here at this Dollar Tree. Very nice location. Very nice location. Very clean, well-stocked. I like it. I like it a lot. Very good. I would shop here if I lived out here. Now, obviously, I like doing these Dollar Tree videos in general, but I like them when they're in an old business like this one. They've taken over a lot of pharmacies, too, I've noticed over the years. So I like them because they're a lot larger and the aisles are wider and they just generally feel cleaner 
than some of the older locations. And I'm not trying to give them a hard time because I love Dollar Tree. But like the one that took over the old Walgreens up in Mars, PA, that one was really nice. I was in there about a week after they opened when I did that video there, and it was fantastic. So this one's just as good, and I hope you enjoyed. If you did, make sure you give the video a like. If you're not a subscriber, please subscribe to the channel for more content. And if you enjoy these Dollar Tree videos, boy, I got to tell you something. We're going to be bringing you a lot more. So, all right, everybody, take care. Stay awesome. Have and a Dollar Tree. Let's just stay. And we'll see you later. Bye. Bye, everyone. Bye.